All right, apologies for the delay. We do now have our quorum, so we can call the Architecture Review Board to order for uh, Monday, May 29th. Uh, Elisa, if you could please call the roll. Zach Ross? Present. Dave Alday? Present. Jerry Jones? Present. Joe Jones. Clark? Present. If everyone could please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of, of the United States, States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Any potential conflicts of interest for our board members today? Hearing none, I'll move to item four, looking for approval of the minutes from May 13th. So moved. Second. Motion and a second. Any further discussion? Hearing none, all those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? Minutes are approved. Thank you very much. Brings us to item number five, our one item for this afternoon, the proposed exterior remodel of the Birchwood Apartments at 3430 and 3434 South 12th Street. Uh, if the applicant could come to the podium so we can get it in the microphone and the viewing audience can hear as well. If you can make introductions and just a brief description of what's being proposed, please. Okay. Um... I apologize in advance. I'm, I'm a little time, hard time hearing from the group up there. But um, um, I'm Mark Thatcher. I own the Birchwood Apartments, 3430, 3432, 3434 South 12th Street, um, about a half block south of South High School on 12th Street. Um, I have pictures of the, I'm going to come up front and pass these pictures out, but uh, what we, what we have now. I think they were in the package that was submitted. So we, we do have those and we can bring them up on screen okay. if you want to reference them. Um, the two apartment buildings behind set way to the west of the street um, behind that old house um, uh, in the foreground um, built in, I'm guessing 1985, mid 80s, uh, what I call a board and batten um, underneath a Swiss chalet look, um, that that stucco is not, that stucco looking stuff is not stucco. It is um, a fiberboard um, with a skin over it's deteriorating, and um, it was my thought to refurbish the thing into what you've got now on on your screen. Do you have any elevations of the end view? This elevation has uh, some interest with the, the decks and the indents to it. The um, elevation that you see more from the street is an I end not, that's pretty, that, that pretty subdued. drawing was made by my contractor, who's not here today. He was trying to attempt to attend by Zoom, but I'm not sure if that worked or not. He's from Appleton. So at least if we go back to the previous photo, so the, the end of the building, we just have the two sets of windows, two in each floor. Yes, correct. Uh, anything else to break up that facade, or the whole thing is just sided uniformly? Um, well, um, we could add something, but I don't think there was anything designed okay. to break up that, that large uh, side elevation of the building. And then if we go back to the elevation drawing, Elise, uh, it looked as if the corner trims here were all the same color as the siding. That's the way it looks on that, on that computer-generated diagram, yes. Uh, the, the lower windows have some sort of differentiation of the trim around them, uh, but the other windows and the doors, the trim seems to all be matching the siding. I'm not clear on what's happening at the decks. Uh, and I don't know if we can see it on that previous picture. Um, I don't believe there's anything there now other than a, um, maybe a one by four wooden, wooden cedar trim board. Either side of their window running from the belt up to the uh, soffit. And is the intent to replace the deck railings, or are those staying uh, as Those is? will be replaced as well. And w what's being proposed for those? Um, green treated uh, um, 
horizontal two by four, two by sixes. That after they weather for a year will be stained undetermined color. That's my intention. And the other question I know came up from uh, staff review was just clarifying whether the office building in front that the house is being modified or if that's just staying as is? Not at this time. Uh, my, my financial ability is just to do the two apartment buildings behind at this time. Okay. Thoughts or comments from the board? Did you want to see this view, Joe? Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Can you bring that one up? Yeah. There's a street view showing a little more of those railings. They're more decorative now. So you said the, the deck railings will be replaced with just a horizontal? Yes, correct. Not a vertical pickets, as I call them. They'll be horizontal. Yep. And overall, I think the buildings are going to be pretty bland, all sided the same and with the trim all blending in. They're set back from the road. They're not really visible. Um, I don't know how much more detailing is really needed. Um, I think just contrasting trim around the windows and the corner boards might not make a... Not what's shown there or specified in their proposal, but um, we could add something. I'm, I'm kind of limited because the, the aluminum soffit fascia and gutters up top is dark brown. Yeah. So I'm kind of limited to what I can do below that and still look decent. Okay. So that we, we did pick out a, uh, a pebble stone clay. I've got a sample of it here. Thoughts from the board on all monochromatic versus introducing something else and if so whether we're comfortable with that just coming back for staff review or if we'd want to see additional documentation. Yeah, I mean, I guess my question is if we bring it back for something else, are you talking brown trim around the windows? Sure, son, is that what you're trying to look for, Joe, uh, to offset it? Yeah, I'm assuming the accent would then be back to the, the basic palette you've got to work with, so like the brown if that's available for corner trim. Sure. Uh, and window surrounds. Okay. Yeah. Um, the out, outside corners, outside corner posts you're talking yeah. about? Yeah. That's okay. what he's talking about. Uh, again, if you bring up that photo, Elise, you know, that's a little more in keeping with what's there now. I mean, not that we need to recreate no, we, that yeah. timber Swiss chalet look, as you call it. <laughs> yeah, um, right. Just concerned with, with such a broad expanse of elevation mm -hmm. not being broken up by anything. Okay. Um, adding some trim differentiation would just give it a little more... Uh, little more texture yeah I don't think it needs a whole lot but just something would help um, and then the other question would be how long afterwards do you anticipate doing the house in front year um, or two I, I would have the financial ability to do that probably not this year sir but mm -hmm. next year for sure 2025. Oh, okay. great great yeah it's just once that whole look is gone they don't look much better <laughs> sure. right. just gotta look at it for a while right right sure I understand no, that's about all that. Just my thought would be if we request that uh, accent color for the corner boards and window surrounds mm -hmm. and any other trim elements sure. uh, and to provide what that would be to city staff yeah, yeah. for their review. Okay. Yeah, I don't think it needs to come back here unless they determine. So, yeah, if Elise is comfortable, yep, with, that. comfortable with that and if, if there are any questions on it, then it can be referred back to the board. But hopefully that gets you so we can keep things moving for you. OK, so Perfect. so I have a motion I, to that effect. So moved. Second. And everyone clear what we are yes. voting on. Correct. I, any further discussion? Hearing none. All those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed. Motion is approved. Thank you very much. Good luck. Uh, thank you. You're clear on um, what we're asking for, and you'll uh, get something I, to sorry. the city. No, you can just submit it to the staff. That you have your contractor submit it to the staff level. You don't have to come to the next meeting. And unless there are any concerns from the city staff, it just gets approved as is. 
um, with that change. Okay. Great. Good All right. Good Great. luck. Thank you very much. All right. Next meeting is scheduled for June 10th, back to a Monday. Uh, if there are no further items for the board, do we have a motion to adjourn? So moved. Yeah. All in favor? Aye. Aye. We are adjourned. Thanks, everyone. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.